Welcome to Sports Talk Radio. I am Noah Cristiano, your host, and I'm here with... Rafael Safranau. And Grayson Webb. So, our first topic for today is the AL Central. What are your thoughts? Uh, so, American League Central is by far the weakest division in all of baseball. You got the Chicago White Sox. They have not had a good year. The Kansas City Royals... Um, an, another horrible year. Uh, the Detroit Tigers, just a disappointing year. Cleveland Guardians, probably the most disappointing of them all, especially after making it to the American League uh, Division Series last year. They're not going to come back anytime soon unless they make the wild card spot and can eventually take over the Twins, who are at first place, who have not been doing, who have not made the postseason since 2019 when they got eliminated by the Yankees in the American League Division Series. Yeah, uh, when you look at, like, when you look at fifth place teams compared to this division, you have the Red Sox that are fourth place and have a better record than the Twins, who are at first place. And the Royals have just, are the second worst team in the MLB. They've been struggling. Tigers have been really bad. Usually you're looking at it, like, usually when you see the Twins, they're, they're a decent team. And, when you look at the Guardians, they've, they've had great success throughout the last decade, and they've been struggling a lot this year as well. And it's just been a mess in this division. It's just, I feel like no one can win a game. It's just been struggling. And these the Tigers and Royals, I think they're going to have over 100 losses at the end of the season. And our second topic is the downfall of the Padres this season. Your thoughts once again? Uh, the Padres... They have so many good players. They have Manny Machado, Juan Soto, Fernando Tatis Jr., but they just haven't been able to produce wins into that, and it's just been a struggle. They need to get the bat on the ball. They need to play correct defense, and I don't know. It looks like so far the manager might not be on the Padres for too long after this season as they just have been struggling coming in. I mean, you, you think when you're looking at this, you see them in this division, the division they're in, you have the Dodgers, Dodgers first, and then you see the Padres, and they just haven't been doing great. They're fourth place right now, and it's just been a real mess here for them. Okay, so let's talk about a couple of things. This starting rotation, not good. And even with Blake Snell, he's now this season been a mediocre pitcher. Everyone else has not has been doing horribly. The bullpen has been decent, but. Now let's move on to the offense. I mean, this is a sad sob story. You got Xander Bogarts, who's just hitting 240. That 11-year deal that was way too long. They're not a, the Padres are not exactly overpaying him, but he's not the superstar level that they paid him for. Uh, and then we got Fernando Tatis Jr. He's not at superstar level. He's still Fernando Tatis Jr. is doing still doing pr- pretty good. But then we got Manny Machado. Off to a horrible start. It's getting a little better, but it's not a good look. He's hitting under 230. We don't know if he can bounce back or not. And Juan Soto. Juan Soto has always been able to be patient at the plate. Draw walks. But although those walks are still coming in, he's not hitting. When he swings the bat, he's either popping up or grounding out. It's not a good look for the Padres. Yeah, um, talk about the bullpen for them. Um... Blake Snell just hasn't been the pitcher he's always has been. And it's just been a real struggle here for the Padres. So, you call him. Okay. So, the phone lines are officially open if anybody has any thoughts. Let's wait a minute here for our calls to come in. So, with the. Oh, here's our first call. Hello? about the Padres, and of course that's my home state. Um, okay, I just okay. to know what your guys' thoughts were. What do you think is going to happen to them in the rest of the season? You guys were mainly just talking about their players like Tatis and Machado, but what do you think is going to happen with them in the rest of the season? Uh, well, I mean, they're in fourth place right now. It, it's They're not making the postseason. They're not going to get a wild card spot. The National League is much more competitive than the American League as of right now. It does not look like that they're making the playoffs, and there's no way that they're clinching their division, and it does, it does not look like that they are going to get a wild card spot anytime soon unless they really start stepping up their game in the second half. Yep. 
Okay, thank you for the call. You're welcome. Bye. Bye. Okay, that is it for Sports Talk Radio. Thank you so much for tuning in, everybody, and thank you for the calls.